Hey guys, I'm Mike Cabagon. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Pikmin 2 in the last episode. Uh, we sh we completed the White Flower Garden and we got White Pikmin. Uh, in this episode, uh, it's not going to be quite as awesome as the last few were because uh, I really kind of screwed myself uh, by doing things the way I did. Because yes, I have more potions, but I couldn't get the, uh, get the pieces I needed to get back. Uh, what do you want, ship? I'll, t I'll explain this in a second. Good morning. The white Pikmin are, are lodged in the, with the purple ones in my hall. The two types are sleeping well and do not quarrel. I have made the most comfortable. You can call out the white Pikmin by standing in the light beneath me in person. Blah. So, same as the purples. Be wary of working yourselves. Take a break. Be courageous, too. To retire early. Oh, yeah. Um, so, if you get into, like, a pinch or something. Like, let's just say you, ha you get yourself caught in a... Uh, in a particularly dicey situation. Actually, what I'm gonna do... So I'm gonna let Louie get the whites. Actually, I need to turn my TV down. So, like, if you get yourself caught in, like, a place where you'd have to walk back through a ton of enemies... Uh, to, uh, get a treasure back or something, or even get back to the ship... All you have to do is just make sure you have all your Pikmin either in the base, in your battalion... Or in the Onion... And you can just go to sunset early, which I might do on some occasions. So, yeah, unfortunately, I really kind of screwed myself because, uh... Now I don't have any dungeons to do. Um, and I have a ton of stuff to actually get done. However, there are still things we can do on this day. It just will not be quite as awesome. Like, the whites up there are getting a treasure. Uh, the one we tried to get earlier. The whites, again, are after that are gonna break down uh, some walls and uh, we can always use this time to uh, make more reds and well what we're gonna do after that is uh, we're going to uh, increase our purple and our white counts because we can go back into the uh, the stuff uh, as you can see that's a good example of white carrying speed they're great uh, I don't even know what this is like an, an onion Pilgrim bulb. It looks like an onion or a bulb of garlic that hasn't quite grown yet. Anyways, it's worth 55 pokos. So we can uh, go back into the Hole of Beasts and uh, the White Flower Garden and uh, salvage this day by getting more, uh, more uh, purples and more whites. And I didn't quite explain this uh, because right now we only have reds. Um, also, I have all flowers, so you guys don't even sort of need to be doing this. Um, with the whites and the purples, because they don't have an onion... Back in your group. Uh, they will be neutral. Oh, re really? Alright, so, I uh, actually, you know what? That wall got broken down already, so... Um, they don't have an onion... Oh, you fiend. These caterpillars have been eating our berries, so I'm gonna kill them so that we can get some more potions at the end of this day. Uh, the whites and the purples, they do not have an onion, so they will, uh... Like, they don't have a bias to which onion they carry stuff towards, so... That is why, uh... With the carrying things... Really? You guys didn't even knock them down? Get up there. Oh, there we go. Uh, so, like, in the first Pikmin game, you could see, like, the number on top was always blue, and the number on the bottom was always red, regardless of where the, the, whatever was being carried was going. So, in this one, it will now turn to whatever color onion it's going to, which makes it so much easier to keep track of. Um, and... The purples and the whites, if you just put purples and whites on, they will just go to a random onion. So, but if you put like one red, or if you put one white and let's say one one yellow on there, it will definitely go to the yellow onion because uh, a Pikmin of color um, uh, neutralizes the bias. If that makes any sense, that that took way longer to explain than it should have. So now we're going to go on a conquest of treasure getting. By that I mean we're going to get literally one treasure. Uh, my goal for this is to... Oh, I know what we're gonna do. 
we are going to, first of all, get this treasure back. And then get some purples. You know what? This day might, this episode might be filled full of stuff. It just might be, what am I doing? What am I thinking? I almost went into battle. With this uh, creeping chrysanthemum with my whites. That would have been atrocious. When I have 25 elite purples to kick ass with. Awesome. Those guys aren't really hard, but in later dungeons, they can get. Their location can get pretty douchey, and you can get kind of screwed. Um, but yeah, we should be able to get a ton of red potions today. Because that is pretty much what this day is going to be dedicated to. Um, there's also another type of potion that we can discover, although we can. there's only one tree. So that we won't be able to get ten. Also, I like how the Pikmin just kind of unfolded there. But we see, this is the second half of the globe that we found in the Emergence Cave. Fascinating. This object highly is similar to the one, is highly similar to the one you found in Valerie Repose. By examining this further, I may be able to extrapolate new planetary data. So, what should have happened is I should have uh, used my time much more wisely and we would have been able to go to a new area in this day, but I didn't. So, that is why we are stuck here. But with a hunt with 95 all flowers on there, that shall travel at mock speeds. So now I just need to figure out what the game plan is. We can do... Let's do potions for a little bit. Uh, uh, okay, yeah. Once these guys get back, I'm going to have Olimar and the Whites go break down a poison wall. So I might use a potion for that. Although I might not. It's not the biggest deal in the world if we don't get it. Because this potion, uh, I burn through much faster. And I always have less of. Um... I think, like, I w I've been doing a, a legitimate run to get through the end of the game with uh, on another file. Wait, did I lose a bunch of Pikmin? I'm highly concerned, because there was 320 on there, and now there was only 267. Uh-oh. This hemisphere also contains a hidden microchip. I will attempt to decrypt the stored data. Did I go and complete the survey chart? So, yeah, this will give us access to a new area. Where are my Pikmin? Wait, where did a bunch of Pikmin just go? Why do I only have 87? That's highly concerning. Please don't be drowning. Where are you? Please be back here, at least. Uh... I'm really concerned. I'm really concerned. What? You- what? Have I broken the game? The game says they're right here. Oh god, no. Okay, uh... New game plan! Uh, one red. Uh, six reds. Uh, this is the emergency plan. Uh, what we're going to do, because apparently those Pikmin are... Wait. Okay, so yeah, there's definitely some purples, some whites, and some reds that are just trapped in limbo there. Uh, so this is what you call a hitch in the giddy-up, but luckily we can get through this without resetting the game. Hopefully. Uh, entering the hole with the Pikmin squad. So I'm going in there with just six reds because what this will do is any Pikmin that are not in my squad get bounced back to their onions. So hopefully, um, I should have brought ten in here. Uh, actually, because then I could have made more purples. Um, okay. Okay, it looks like they all went back. Whew. All right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to quit. Okay. That was really scary. <laughs> Never a dull moment. Stuff like that can happen sometimes. Like I talked about in my first Pikmin Let's Play. 
that it is not impossible to lose Pikmin on day one of Pikmin 1. Okay, do I have everyone still? Okay, I'm mostly concerned. Okay, good. Oh, I was mostly concerned about the purples, to be completely honest. Whew, that was really scary. Okay, um, wow. If you need excitement in your life, play Pikmin 2. Although that was a bit much. Okay, so at least our treasure got back. Alright, so let's divvy up. That set us back a little bit. So we won't be able to kick quite as much ass as I was hoping. And now these stupid caterpillars are gonna... You know what, I better get the squad ready to deal with those fiends. Because I hate them. They are so annoying. Like, those uh, berries are hard enough to get as it is. I really hope the uh, helmeted guy hasn't come back. Okay, good. He's not back. How are we doing over here? Oh, they will spawn. Where are the caterpillars? Nowhere to be found. I'm down with this. They will show up instantly and start munching on the berries. Okay, so luckily we can do... Like, since all I'm going to be doing is just rushing with red Pikmin into uh, the dungeons, we really don't need that much time. Because all you got to do is make a straight shot. So we can do that even when we're in our, like, 10-second countdown. As long as we're set up before that. So the rest of today, of this part, will just be grinding. So I might even just make some cuts because there's not much that I can show that's actually going to be interesting. Other than the discovery. Actually, you know what? We'll be able to do a little bit more uh, once again than I had originally planned. This day is not going to be a total waste. I like that. So I might just, I might make some cuts depending on what happens. I'm going to keep commentating just in case I don't cut. Um... But yeah, so I guess I could talk about the mess of stuff that's going to be going up on my channel. Here's a, here's all what happened. So I originally, I did about four episodes of a different Let's Play. Uh, it was Majora's Mask. I can go ahead and say it, it was Majora's Mask. Uh, and I'm super happy with those episodes. But I, when I went to go practice the game, because that is a, a game that need that requires ample time for practice. Uh, I just, I couldn't get it. Like, I just, I never could find the uh, enough, t like, enough time to sit down and practice and, like, write down what I actually need to do to be successful. So, uh, I'm not going, we're probably, this is going to be dicey, actually. We're not going to have as much time as I thought. Um, so I decided that I will get back to Majora's Mask later. Um, you know what? Then, uh, I've got to do, uh, The Force Unleashed, which I have to actually start playing again, because I haven't played it since I recorded it last. And then I need to do, uh, Travis and I are continuing to do, uh, Pokemon Leaf Green, and we also recorded, uh, the start of a new Let's Play, but we need to finish it before, uh, we publish it, because it can just go up by its own. Oh, one second. Okay, so Loki wanted out. Um, so after that, so how these are going to wrap up is it will go, oh yeah, and Pokemon Emerald bonus content has started going up. Okay, break those guys, break those, break those, break those. Um, and then what the deal is, is uh, Pokemon Emerald bonus stuff and okay guys I'm gonna leave you all here uh, but I don't probably have like 10 episodes of that left at that because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna complete the pokedex in that I'm literally just showing off the battle frontier and some other secrets and uh... whoa that could have been nasty Get that one white up there. I said get that one white up there. So then how these are going to end is it's... I'm going to try and make it go... I hope this is 15. Pokemon Emerald will end. Force Unleashed will end. Then I will get back to... I will have Pikmin going up along that. And Fire Red... Leaf Green going up along that. 
Uh, then we will get to a new Let's Play with Travis and I. And then we should be good. Then that should take care of all the clutter. Because I admit there's a lot of mess on my channel right now. And I've been taking steps to uh, clean it up. As you can see, our dice is getting back. Okay. Be -do 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 -do. There we go. A chance totem. Okay, so... Now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna throw... A bunch of Pikmin up there for Olimar. Because we're gonna have to do this quite quickly, actually. Uh, you know what? Nope. It's not gonna happen. 27 will be enough. Let's go. Sorry, Berries. I have to leave you here. Uh, and I have to abandon my plan. But that's okay. We got a treasure, which is much more important. So, now what we're going to do is we're going to dip back into the hole of beasts and create some more purple. So I will go right to the purple floor. Damn it. There are no purple flowers here. I don't understand. I don't get what the reset is for these ones. Because sometimes they're here and sometimes they're not. Oh well. There's definitely some on the next floor, or on the fourth floor, so we will definitely get some more purples. It just will only be five, so that kind of sucks. Okay, so I created successfully five awesome new purples. And I'm almost positive that the same thing is going to happen at the White Flower Garden. So, I don't know. I'll try to get in there. But I kind of think this will not work. But just to be safe, let's put the purples back. Uh, let's let's try and rush into the, to the Flower Garden and see if the white... Uh, the white flowers have returned. Unlike their purple counterparts. That was really kind of disappointing. I only got five when I could have got 15. Oh well, it happens. Okay, let's go see if the white flowers have returned. Ha! They have. Very cool. So at least this is all... This is not all for naught. It's mostly for naught. But not all for naught. Only mostly. And now let's find those honey wisps. So I can get them all flowered. It's less important to have more white. The only thing it does is it gives you a bit more of a wiggle room. Uh, for if you want to kill them. When you they can like feed them to enemies. Which, I don't know. There's some enemies. I gotta think of any that like actually eat Pikmin. Uh, that I might exploit that with. But again, I'm also trying to have really low Pikmin death counters. <clears throat> but we shall see. We'll get there when we get there. But we get 15 more whites. I believe that brings us up to 30. That is... We don't really need that many more whites to go on the rest of the game, actually. It's quite nice. But let's get them all flowered, and then we will... We will give up our conquest for more treasure that doesn't actually exist here. Damn it, one white. Are you kidding me? Are you some kind of game? Is it, what are you some kind of game? Do you think this is some kind of game? I'm I need to go back to sleep. I'm very tired apparently. Okay, so let's go ahead and take our white pikmin and our reds and get out of here. Okay, so that was not too too bad. I ended up getting two treasure three treasures. Uh, a couple more potions. Unfortunately, I used one. And, uh, I got five more purples and 15 more whites. You know what, I'll just go right to sunset, even though there's three seconds left. Just so I can show it off, you can go to sunset. Yes. So that's not too, too bad. Uh, I'm wondering what this journal entry, or this email is going to be, because usually, there's not many days like this that I just don't do much of anything. Wow, there's no enemies at all there, actually. That's kind of funny. I wonder if you kill all... Mm -hmm. Yeah, if, if you kill all the enemies, what happens if you leave one behind? 
Because there's nothing, there's nothing hiding. Yeah, it was a safe enough area. So yeah, 355, that's not too, too bad. Excuse me, but the big one we got is a geographic projection and the survey chart, which we can go to a new area tomorrow. And our Pikmin death count remains at zero. I like that. Olimar, good work so far. I hereby promote you to perennial manager. Press X to divide up work and Y to divide to delegate more to your subordinate leader. Hope all goes smoothly. Actually, that happened because I hit 30% of the debt. So if I didn't get some of those treasures, this kind of this would have been a had the potential to be a very funny email. All right, so let's go on, and we're going to see the awesome new menu display thing. By awesome new menu display thing, I meant we're going to have the perplexing pool revealed. But uh, we will be going there in the next episode because we're going to get some new Pikmin types. Uh, so with that, guys, I've been iCapagon. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and a comment as well. As subscribe for more videos like this one if you have not done so already. Don't forget to check out LP Years Unknown as well as follow me on Twitter. Until then, guys, I am signing off.